Hey, it's Luke here, coming to you live from wherever the hell this place is. You know what really grinds my gears? Technology. I have this Bluetooth set thing here. And it's only, it's only been nine days, and the right one doesn't work. Like, the fuck is this shit? Nine days. Of course, the camera broke my laptop randomly one day, too. I really don't... I just don't get it, man. I just... I'm tired of wasting goddamn money, dude. So much money. And stupid shit like this. Like, this camera was like, what, $100? This video game costs $100? And stupid shit like that, man. I don't even know anymore. Jesus. But, good news. I did my audition last night. I got a call back for today. You, you know what's another good thing? My boss was like, hey, yeah, uh, someone will close for you. They're showing up 5.30 to close. I'm like, hell yeah, I have to be there at 6. And my official callback time is 7 o'clock, which I didn't tell her that. Because I originally thought it was going to be 6. So, boom, two birds with one stone. One thing I'm really proud of lately is telling people what I mean without being nervous about it. I'm really grateful for that. Like, I feel, most of my life, like, I hate saying anything. I hate suggesting anything. I hate calling off. I hate requesting off. I hate asking my family for stuff. I just hate it. I'd rather just do it and then say thank you later than actually, you know, ask them first. But anyways, this is... This just means I'm so much closer. Basically, basically halfway through of getting casted. And you know what that means? That means that there's a chance that my school might get a grant so I could go to London. I'm pretty sure I have to pay for a passport and do all that stuff myself, but like, hell yeah. Who would not like that? Well, the one thing I'm, like, afraid of, though, is, you know, what that's not going to happen. Like, the first time I heard of the show was during the director slash casting agent slash my acting professor said, um, like, oh, yeah, we're going to get this grant thing to do it for the show. Like, anyone could sign up for this culture class. But the next thing... She says when I schedule for the class, like oh, it's only for people who are in measures measure. I'm like, okay, that's a different change. She didn't mention the grant thing. I'm pretty sure you would advertise that when people audition. You probably get more people auditioning then. But I have a feeling it didn't go through, or she just forgot about it. And I think that's kind of a flaw. But either way, I'm excited for tonight and see what happens. For the real and gritty stuff. Crime wise. I really haven't been doing anything. I just. Once you've been exonerated. Like a couple days ago. You really don't feel like. You know doing another thing. And you might think. What? He actually felt sorry for doing what he did? Of course I did. Nonsense dude. I'm a fucking human too. Well, I'm going to talk about Derek Mark again. Even though he really only made an appearance in name only, Thayer Rock is definitely a character. And let me pronounce that again. Thayer Din Rock. And it's not spelt the way normal English, or at least United States English is pronounced. But I'll leave that for another day. He's definitely a character. Um... So if I ever mention creator of death or the creator of something or the god of this world, it's always going to be Theron Rock. You know, I, I really don't know what I'm doing with this series or this fictional world I'm creating. I'm tempted to say just to not have it or just keep going and start rambling on, but... 
I think eight is a good number to end it off, or at least have a temporary hiatus. So, I know not a lot of people watch this, and no one comments. I don't know what people think. But for cryptic sake, I think I'm going to let this lie. And I'll let you figure out in my other videos if who I am or what this is is actually me or not. I know that's my go-to thing. Like, oh yeah, just say it's up to you. It's up to you. It's up to you. I know that's not very accessible or nice of you. But like, to me, I feel like this is very obvious what it is. I'm not going to tell you how obvious it is or in what direction, but it's there. So, for all you out there, uh, whoever watches eventually, or maybe it's just a couple of viewers I got in these videos, videos, which I'm very grateful for. I didn't realize people would actually watch this. I thought it would be just for me. But, I mean, this is just for me. This is for me to, you know, get used to looking at a camera and, you know, acting or blah, 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 blah. Take that as you will. So, for all the cryptic people out there, there's always mistakes that I can make or you can make. Just keep your wits about you, okay? Toodles.